but we want to, want to come here and celebrate the fact that we have some survivors here in the audience who are willing to come up on the stage and briefly tell a little bit of their story because everyone has a story. It doesn't matter who you are, where you come from, everyone has some type of story. They can be joyous, they can be painful, they can be tragic, but we all have that as a part of the human experience. United States military is in the same fight that you are facing on campus. We recognize that and we have changed our culture over the last decade to do our absolute best to stop what we just saw on TV. 18 years old, dream boyfriend. I want to wait till marriage, till it's special. He waits until I'm too drunk to move. 18 years old, three best friends. Let's get drunk and play video games. They stop drinking. Pour me more. How many until she forgets? Bring me down today. Oh, oh yeah, but you know, I would never let my daughter or my son, you know, join the military, they have to go to college. They have to go to the university. Why? Well, you know, I don't want them to get sexually assaulted. Because it's not happening at the universities. Okay? It's not happening at the universities. They'll be safe there. You know what? <coughs> Wrong. Okay? I mean, no, it's happening everywhere. Breath on my body as I trembled in fear. As I see my Aunt Rachel's face, as it were an angel in front of me. Don't you believe in God? Don't you believe in God? First thing I'm going to tell you is that they're drugged through the mud, whether you're a male or a female. They come forward, sometimes you're drugged through the mud. They pick every bad choice you ever made, and they make an up, a big up spectacle about it. Slogan that goes, if it happens in Vegas, it stays in Vegas. And I can't tell you how many problems we got from that slogan. <coughs> dealing with this very subject, sexual assault. Because the guys that came there thought they could just do whatever the hell they wanted to. I choose to love others because I have felt unloved. I've learned that I'm beautiful and strong. I'm a free, independent woman who's born to live, to love, to hope, and to dream. I am a survivor.